Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Modern Cube Draft. Let's not even talk about companions right now because Jesus, those are those are some some messed up cards, man. All right, all right, Thank all you. right. Unseen Specter, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. <clears throat> all right, um, what are we taking here? We got some stipulations to do. We'll do them when Mike is here. We got a. Each pick has to have something in common with the last. And we also have a dialect stiff, so we'll do those. I heard Garrick is good as well, man. Garrick is good in the cube. Uh, I kind of like Bone Crusher Giant here, to be quite honest with you. Actually, I think this is the best card in the pack. Ooh, Euro. I like a Euro. It's one of my favorite forms of currency. That's not true. I really don't have any preference. I'm not a real... I don't, I don't really care about currency. I'll take Euro. Ooh, Rootbound Crag goes quite well with both of these cards. Let's take a Rootbound Crag. Oh, Lumbering Falls goes quite well with these two cards. Let's take a Lumbering Falls. I got a Magmatic Sinkhole. Thank you. Pretty good in terms of removal. Bob the Sheep, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. I got the AC cranked up so I can wear a hoodie inside. What a what a time to be alive. What a wild. What a crazy little goose. I think it's Lumbering Falls here. I think Jade Light Ranger is good too, but I just don't like care that much. I just don't. I just don't care that much. Clever and Person here is pretty decent. Any non-land permanent, huh? Or Garrick. I think it's Clever Impersonator. Uh, I got a Vraska and a Thrag Tusk and a pull from Tamaro. Pull from to you get Tamaro and you just pull it right out. Uh, I think it's just Thrag Tusk here. I think you're a little fuzzy. Oh, for fuck's sake, Kerwood, it's got to end, man. There we go. Thank you for the update, though. I actually wouldn't have known. Pack of Negation? Eh. I think it's probably the best card in this pack, and it can be a game winner. Dude, I turn off the autofocus every day. Literally every time I stream, I manually turn off the autofocus. And then additionally, it will literally turn, it's literally turned itself back on before. Like, look, watch, let me go to control, focus, auto is off, okay. Now let's see if I get fuzzy again at any point during the stream. I actually like char better than roast. Char goes face. Roast do not. Frost Titan came back. That's fascinating. I like Collected Company. It can hit Euro and Bone Crusher. I don't think we want to hit either. Well, we, want, we don't hit Euro. Or we don't hit, we don't want to hit Bone Crusher. I'll just take Frost Titan. Oh, Raging Ravine? Okay. Okay. Shut up and take my money. Stay crispy, my friend. <laughs> trying, buddy. I'm trying. One crispy buck. All right, I'm going to turn this fan off because it's actually a little chilly in here. Uh, 
Outpost Siege is actually okay. I don't hate it. Also, Hangerback Walker is fine too, so I mean, get over there. You know what? I'll keep you in the main deck for now. Thank you. Hey, Saru, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. I like a nimble obstructionist. Sorry I haven't been around lately to support. My mother passed away unexpectedly in January. Dude, I'm so kept on. I'm so sorry, man. I'm trying to care for my autistic brother with a little experience in such things. It's been a rough ride, especially with the ride. Dude, Cabal, man. I hope you're okay, man. That sounds terrible. I'm so sorry, man. Yeah, I mean, me and Mike have been doing all right so far. There's no real, no real issues. For the autofocus, have you hit apply after you turn it off instead of hitting just okay? So the thing about that is in Windows, if you hit apply, it just means you apply it before you leave the window. If you hit okay, okay also applies everything that you do before leaving. So if I go to properties here and I go to configure, camera control, focus is still off and apply is not, not available. When you hit okay in Windows, it automatically applies your features. Apply just means you can still keep working in that window and it applies it before you leave. So if I want to apply something but still want to work in the window, you, that's why you hit apply. You don't, you don't have to hit apply before you leave a window. That's a little Windows trivia for you guys. Sort of Feast and Famine is a good one. Well, hey, got my interceded program just work like... <laughs> yeah, no, that's just how it goes. That's a common misconception. Yeah, Hajulashi, the thing about that is I've tried to do that actually. But here's the problem. In the in the Logitech software, which is actually pretty good, the G Hub software. Shut up and take my money. One tech support bug. In the G Tech in the G support software, there is like if I go to video. There's no video focus. You have brightness, contrast, sharpness, white balance, saturation. For camera, there's a focus. But that's just for still, I would imagine. Actually, I have a new camera mode. Maybe if I just go to turn auto off. All right, let's see if this will stick. And let's also make a pick. Because <laughs> of cards. I'm gonna take just I'm gonna take six, 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 blah, 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 blah. I'm just gonna take the sword. I think sword is super strong in this in this particular cube. Someone carry out it seems great here. Tarmog seems meh. Crater hoof seems good, but I don't think we're a crater hoof deck. I think I'd rather just have Sylvan carry added to fix. We have no two drops as well, so. Alright, let's see if G Hub remembers our settings. No beats, I did get your package. I did. I have not tried it on yet though. So. Simic signet I like. <laughs> I see. <laughs> I mean, I just got back yesterday. I was trying. Actually, Bloodbraid Elf seems better than anything else in this pack, right? I'm gonna take Bloodbraid Elf. We don't have any counter spells yet. Like even hitting any of these is pretty good. Oh God, can you imagine hitting Pact of Negation? Let's put Pact in the sideboard now. I mean, I guess we just don't cast it, right?
Uh, Coalition Relic seems good. <sighs> Actually, Noble Hierarch seems better. I mean, we have so many three drops already. I want to ramp into three. I don't want to. I don't want to ramp on three. Ooh, Stomping Ground seems fantastic. How was the drive? Oh god, so long, dude. So long on both days, but otherwise pretty smooth. I like a Venser here. I also like a Karn. Domri's meh. I think we want Venser here. This is a very interactive uh It's a very interactive uh, deck, I guess. I don't. I don't hate Gadwick, but I also don't love. The, actually, Love Struck Beast could be good here. Let's take Love Struck Beast. If now Pian and Pian Colonel R isn't coming back, well, I mean, actually, maybe that's maybe that's better. We just don't have a ton of one ones, so if we don't, if we actually hit this off of Bloodbraid Elf, like we don't actually ever get to. I'll take Pian Colonel R. I'll put the output siege over here. Uh, Windswept Key seems good because we can get uh, Stomping Ground currently. Oh, Katie, my love. Here we go again on our own. <laughs> Going down the only road we've ever known. Like a... I, I, I used to know someone who thought it was like a twister. I was born to walk alone, and I'm like, that doesn't make any sense. Like a twister? It's like a drifter. I forgot who that was, though. I think it's funny when people misconstrue song, song lyrics like that. <clears throat> Uh, none of these cards are exciting. Thank However, I could take Jamoka's Command in case you want to splash it. Jojo MK, thanks so much for the resub. Really appreciate it. Oh, Stamp Draft. Oh, yes. I'll take Wolf Willow Haven, I guess. That seems fine. Oh, Champion of Wits? Not terrible. Not terrible. We have another pack still. Our deck looks pretty decent right now. I see a Swaggy Bay and a Frosty TT. Why two T's? Frosty, Frost, Frosty TT? That's like a Frost TT. That's like three T's actually. <laughs> Frost. <laughs> oh, gravy. Katie's roommate's dog is called Tonto, and they call him TT because Tonto. But now she's calling Frost Titan TT as well, so. I think we just want Farseek here. God, I love a Cryptic Command, but Triple Blue's a little rough, and our blue fixing is not at its best.
Same. I had the same feeling for Lotus Cover, but I also like Mull Drifter here. I think it's Mull Drifter here. God, I love a Mull Drifter. It's like the best card you can ever play in your deck. Oh, I like a Tamio a lot, actually. Tamio is surprisingly good. I want to take Tamio. I like a Rex Sage. Oh, I like a Ral too. Oh, we can actually play Ral. We can also play Chandra. Oh, that's exciting. What was I gonna take? Rex Sage? Shoot. But like a twister, I was born to walk alone. I think I think it is Chandra, because I think the Ral will actually table. I think we can either get Ral or Rex Sage back. I'm gonna take the Chandra due to that. Oh man, that's so bad. Because we got Batter Skull earlier too. That's sad. I'm going to take Pyroclasm because this has proven to be very, very good in this format. Well, at least Sweepers have been. I don't know if Pyroclasm specifically is going to get the job done all the time, but we did have a, a match that was a blowout with a Pyroclasm. So. You can also take Rashmi, which is kind of cute. I think we want more two drops, though. <laughs> you know, unlike Nyx Bloom Ancient or... You know, Dragon Lord Tarka. Although, realistically, I could see playing Dragon Lord Tarka. Or Inferno Titan. I made up my mind. Uh, I think it's just Inferno Titan, to be honest. Well, I had Inferno Titan selected, but I guess I didn't really I didn't really select it, so instead we got Nissa. Well, that's unfortunate. I guess we'll just take Thunder Maw. Selected it, but not really selected it. Ancient Grudge actually seems fine here. I don't think we need mana confluence. Um God, do you like a Fallen Shinobi? <laughs> Unfortunately, we have no way to cast this. I guess it's just Forked Bolt here. Uh, Modern Cube is literally here until tomorrow, I believe. The 22nd. Uh, Carnage Tyrant's actually alright. I guess that's kind of a replacement for the Inferno Titan that we selected, but didn't select. Shut up and take Search my Press Conta seems fine. I miss traveling. Must draft Floaty Boys and Planeswalker since they can go anywhere. Oh, that's actually hilarious. Oh, man. Flying Creatures and Planeswalkers. That's nice. Judge MK, I love how uh, open-ended these steps are for me. You're always like, yeah, do this, but then like, make sure your deck is fine and don't worry about it too much. Sweltering Suns, and do we get any of those four cards back? I don't think so. I could see the Nyx Bloom Ancient coming back. But otherwise, I think our deck ended up fine. Judge MK, thank you so much for the for the support. Really appreciate it. We get a Terminus. I hear you're like, so oh, Jesus. Bazzer, how? Good gravy. What are the bombs in Modern Cube? I don't even know, actually, to be quite honest with you. 
Like a drifter, I was born to walk alone. Alright, I'm gonna write this stipulation down so I don't forget it. Floaty boys. <laughs> I love it. All right. Um, we need two cuts. I'm not a huge champion of wits fan. Um... I mean, I feel like most of our lands are going to produce green. We also have Wolf, Willow, Haven, Sylvan Carry added, Noble Hierarch, and Farseek. So I don't think it's that big of a deal. Plus, you can always hit it with Bloodbraid Elf, which is pretty sweet. Two cuts. I think it might be Champion of Wits. You like it to main your swords, yes? I do. I do like to main my swords. That was Italian. Sorry if it was confusing. No, buddy. I got it. I knew. I knew. I guess Forked Bolt can go. That's not super exciting. All right, so four, five, six, seven. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Seven, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight. Done. Triple green's rough. <laughs> oh, man. But the point I was going to say was that, uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve green sources. So <sighs> I'll keep it, even though we can't play this until turn three. Unless we hit a green source, we did. We're very good at this game. Badger with the 20 gifted subs, my dude. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate you. Thank you. And you are utterly ridiculous. 
Well, if they wasted in center on that. Dude, Badger, thank you so much, man. Thank you. <laughs> oh, man. That's ridiculous. Oh, Cabal with the gifted sub. Nice. Tukili, gra you. my grandma. Valterek9, Lance. Nice. Bobby Biscuits. This is a pretty sweet array of... Uh... Okay, so... Thank you. Basically, if they go untap Feller Guardian, we get to lose the game on the spot. Thank you. Which is always fun. Badger man, you are unreal, dude. I Thank appreciate you. you. Thank you. All right, let's see if you got it. Here we go. Thank you. Oh. Sure. Thank you. Fascinating. Not a land. Not a land one time. Char. Thank you. That's interesting. Thank you. Thank you. So next turn, it's going to be a lot of thank yous, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Remember that time we were talking about Pyroclasm? Oh, yeah. Right here. Thank you. How many creatures do we have in our deck? I don't even know. Thank you. I mean, we can play Tamio and draw four cards here, but then we die. Thank you. So that's rough. We go, he's like, yeah, draw four, and then I'll kill you. Two, four, six, eight, ten. This puts us to twelve. Thank you. Thank you. I don't actually think this is good enough. I mean, we get to we go to two here, and if they have any like burn spell. Oh my god! Did the thank yous end? Oh man, thank you for the thank yous ending. Oh yeah, we're definitely bringing Pyroclasm. Take my money. No backseas draft. If you put a card into your deck or sideboard while drafting, it stays there. You can sideboard after first game of each match. Lands are the exception. I mean, if I double click on a card and it goes to my main deck, I can move it to the sideboard. Unless I can, I, let's make sure I can make a conscious choice here, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, we're just dead. Okay, let's bring in Pyroclasm. You guys are ridiculous. Thank you. Yeah, I want to make sure, like, if I dis, I want to make, I want to be able to decide whether it goes into the into the main deck of the sideboard, and not just have me like accidentally click it into one or the other. That's, I think, that's the only. Snoozlemo, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. White Man Project, thank you so much for the resub, guys. Really appreciate it. Badger, thank you so much for the twenty freaking gifted subs, dude. You are consistently one of the most generous. Viewers and supporters and human beings on the planet, man. I love you, dude. Also, Kerwit giving stipulations is wild. What a what a what a world what a world we're living in. Alright. Forked bolt also seems fine. Let's take out Nimble Obstructionist. Actually, Nimble Obstructionist can break up the combo for a minute. Thank you. Take out Carnage Tyrant and probably... I do like Rashmi a lot. Let's take out Clever Impersonator. Oh, Haji Galashi with the gifted sub. Thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate it. To good old Chef Boy RD. 
Can I give a snip? For sure, Badger. So here's the thing. I don't know how many I'm going to have time to do, though. I already have four in the queue right now. <laughs> the cube goes away tomorrow. So, like, I really got to... I really got to... Got to do things. I got I to gotta make Thank sure we're... Uh... Elves is... I don't even think there's any elves in this cube. Oh, good gravy. Zaichi, give a tier one sub Thank to you. God. Oh my God. Hodgkulashi, thank you for the gifted sub to the Jolly Green Giant. What's better here, Farseek or Sylvan Carry Added? I think it's Sylvan Carry Added. Hmm. So we can go hollow on this guy. Oh, Haji Galashi, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Brawny. Haji Galashi, making sure the uh let's get a stomping ground. Making sure all of the name brands are supported during the during the quarantine. do anything to a planeswalker oh yes it does we can go negative four on this sahili rye that seems good or we can just play bloodbraid elf the problem is bloodbraid elf does not kill. oh we can't they can't create a token oh they can play cat blink this yeah so we really want to just play chandra here one two three four five six thank you zet love thank you so much for the for the sub really appreciate it welcome welcome you guys are fantastic And we just hope they don't kill our Chandra, but they might. They have Incinerate, but then it's a two for one, so. Thank you. Hodge with the gifted sub to Charmin. <laughs> Why do these accounts exist, is my question. Oh, well, it's you, boy. Each non-elemental creature. It's like, well, those are elementals, you see. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, I think we forgot to play the Windswept Teeth last turn. I think that's still fine. That's going to be a rough draft. Hey, oh, hey. I actually don't know how many elves are in this queue. I think it's like. There's Reclamation Sage. I don't know if the, like. If there's, like, Elvish Mystic in here. What up, TPO? Uh, sure.
Thank you. Sea Monk, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. These are going face, right? Yeah. You fool. Well, we do get to keep Chandra. Well, that's pretty sweet. I'm eating an untoasted bagel like it's the Middle Ages. <laughs> Don't you have a really nice toaster that you spent way too much money on, my dude? Thank you. Govbatur, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Good morning from Japan. <laughs> I missed you live for a while, still lurking on these. Totally fine, dude. Need some advice to let my daughter watch the Jurassic Bark episode of Future Roman. Now she's locked in a room with the dog crying her eyes out. Do I just let it run? It's good gravy, man. Uh, TPO, I did get your email. And I even loaded up your new deck list. Um, and we're just going to pass here. This Golar Bringer is not going to be a problem this turn. So... We can also crack this, make a wolf, and double block the two elementals. Thanks for all the content on YouTube in these crazy days that I can't work. At least I can do to... <laughs> How you doing, guy? Thank you so much for saying so, man. Really appreciate it. My toaster is made for bagels. And these bagels I got are really fat and it keeps burning them. Well, you know, like you do. Oh, Super Fritz, you get to hang out with me tonight? That's pretty sweet. I imagine it's easier to watch the stream in store now since you're probably only doing like pickup and delivery orders. Wait, why can't I? Oh, this is only during as a sorcery? That's weird. Why is that only during your turn? What a weird stipulation. Really, I don't know how to deal with Master Waves and Thassa, so that's pretty unfortunate. Yep, that is pretty hard to deal with. Minusing Chandra doesn't get rid of Master of Waves. And then they just make more guys next turn. Okay, sure. <sighs> yeah, also if you minus three, it doesn't get rid of any of the elementals. So, like, it's just minusing Thassa is just the worst possible play from every metric. I just don't know how we win this game. And I'm pretty sure we actually can't, so... Uh, we have no answer to Master of Waves, and I, I think in any of our deck. Yeah. All right. Well, that was less fun than I would have liked it to be.
Uh, because it comes back immediately. So when state-based effects are actually checked, uh, there's still a master of waves in play. Well, two six drops and two five drops is not really where I want to be. It's a little better. If we can hit a green source, we can uh, play our Steel Leaf champion. We did not. Do, 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 do. I'm loving it. Is that guy singing the McDonald's song? I'm pretty sure I'm just going to bounce this coalition relic when they go to put a counter on it. Nope. That's not what you want to do. Nope. It's not what I want to do. I like that the steps have become more and more reasonable over time. Yeah, I think people are like less less inclined to be like, you can only have four drops and six drops in your deck. And it's like, oh, oh really? All right, well... I think it's also that people just don't want to do those. Like, I'm not going to just do it. So I think it's like, give me a general idea of what you want to see. And we can try to make that happen. Elves. <laughs> oh, good gravy. Elves. Here's an elf. Actually, this is an elf, so. Dang it, stop having that for green. Shut up and take my money. Draft at least one card. <laughs> Deal. I think I can handle it. I think I can handle it. Alright, hold on, I'm gonna write that down. Cause that's gonna be funny once I actually do it. That's amazing. That's actually hilarious. <laughs> oh, Christ. Oh, good. Bribery. Enjoy my... What's the best card you could possibly get without looking? Frost Titan? Probably Frost Titan. Draft only one card. I'd be like, uh, uh. Thundermaw Hellkite. That seems worse than 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 Frost Titan to me. Especially because you know I have a Tamiyo. Interesting. Glory. 
glory bringer. Okay, sounds good. Do you kill my noble hierarch and attack my tomato? Sure. Seems good. Oh, I wish I had a second blue. God, can you imagine how good a second blue would be to let me cast my fucking spells? That would be amazing, dude. Then I could actually clever impersonator Venser, bounce my own Thunder My Hulk Kite, and keep their Glorybringer tap down. That would be so cool. But instead, only one blue. Can't cast it. Thank you, Ben. Thank you. Always. Always helpful. I'm here to help. Always on your side. <laughs> look at look at Swaggy Bay go. They're at ten. That's two hits from Swags. Are they just coming at Tamio with their with their colonnade? That would be my guess. No, they're going to Inferno Titan instead. Or they're going to Walking Ballista. That's worse, but... Okay, you got it. Remember the time I put seven blue sources in the deck just to make sure we had enough? Me too. Do, 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 do. Eh, might as well sword four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Sipai, you make a mono blue deck, but you can't pick the following cards. Cryptic Command, Jace the Mind Sculptor, Venser, Frost Titan, or Shaldaka. Thanks. So basically you want me to have a mono blue deck without any of the fun mono blue cards that make it any good whatsoever. Why like what's the the the, the, the only the only purpose of that stipulation is to just make sure you don't win. Have you ever thought of creating your own colony? I'd move to a Lepore, a Lepore colony for sure. Well, you know what they say. So this deck seemed very cool, but then we ended up not doing very well with it. So that's cool. I guess that's... Uh, I mean, we lost to literally one card, Master of Waves, in the first round. And, uh, you know... What can you do? <sighs> yep, seems good. You can only draft cards with more than one mana symbol. Like, like what? So, like, this would have two mana symbols? Because this has two mana symbols. It has the four mana symbol and the green mana symbol. Hmm. 
Maybe my package will make things better. <laughs> Solid phrasing. Oh, and then they're just gonna bounce it with Jace. That's actually fantastic. Look at how look how their fucking their hand has exactly everything they needed to deal with all my creatures on board. That's wild, man. If we can hit a land, I guess we could play Chandra and kill Thunder Maha Hellkite. Well, didn't draw a land. Yeah. All right. Well, this has been a fun. This has been a really fun series of matches so far. Just kidding. Not that fun at all. So what do you see? Ancient Grudge. We saw. Um. Just Coalition Relic. Wait, is... Yeah, it's true. I guess I just need more companions. I'm looking at the deck and I'm like, all our cards seem pretty decent. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten sources of blue in the deck. Of course, if we can't draw a second blue, it seems harder to win, <laughs> for sure. Let's keep it. I don't know if I like Pact here. I just I, having the five man and the double blue has just not been my strong suit this match, this this draft, this series of. Let's get another island. Oh my god, Sammy, how you doing, buddy? <laughs> boom, boom, doom, doom, doom. Boom, doom, doom. Oh, what are you doing with your life? Well, I guess we'll just play you and either Thrag Tusk or Steel Leaf next turn. I don't think I'm killing this when they have like Glorybringer and stuff in their deck. And Jace. This is the best we can do. Next turn we can Chandra, which is nice, but you should put an RPG badge logo in your sponsor section. <laughs> You're not wrong. Fairgrounds Warden. Okay, so we get a beast. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> they 
Yankees. I'm not sure if I want to like, I'm not sure if I want to Chandra negative three here. They do have negate. We know. Oh, they can't actually, or they do have remand. They can't actually, can you remand a Chandra? I don't know the wording on remand. I think it says counter target spell. If you do return it to their hand and draw a card. Oh, nice. That's pretty good. What companion are we playing? Good lord. Jesus. I, I that's my my article that's going up tomorrow is about to actually companions, so. So now the question is, do we just plus one and not care about their stupid fairgrounds warden? I think so. Blink of an eye. That's nice because if we did negative three, they would have bounced their fairgrounds warden. And then we would have lost our Thrag Tusk and just kept our three three. And they would have just been able to replay three replay uh fairgrounds warden, so not a terrible uh, outcome. To a Chandra. You see, I've mixed you up with someone else. I understand. Oh, good. A Jace the Mind Sculptor. We have a Raging Ravine and they just... They didn't plus Jace. Fascinating. We could also just char Jace and play Steel Leaf Champion, which is pretty decent. What's for dinner? I have no idea. I just had lunch. I had KFC for lunch. For the first time in a long time. Okay, that's actually probably better because it puts a body on the board and gets rid of the Jace. One, two, three, four, five. And we get to keep the, uh... I'm sorry. I mean, I'm not. It was delicious. Man. Snobbery in food choices is pretty... Is Are we still doing that in 2020, man? That's wild. No, I did not try Impossible Chicken at KFC because I don't know of any KFCs that have it. It was very limited. And I don't even know if they're still doing that. Yeah, I just I don't think I was around a KFC that was doing Impossible Chicken when it, when it was available. I would have loved to try it though. Yeah, put that Chandra back down to six. She'll be dead soon. Oh look, they only got four lands. That's too bad. Man, Magic games are less fun. When you don't draw your friggin' lands. Well, if you get sick at KFC, obviously you're going to have a different take for sure. I'm just saying, I, I did not get sick, and I, I had a pretty, it was a pretty enjoyable meal. Um, yeah, let's make you another, just put you, give you another, uh, give you another emblem. And we're just going to try to close this game out as quick as we can. Condemn, huh? Okay. Everybody needs a little mulder after remand. 
Sure, my dude. Sure, my dudicus maximus. Oh, uh, I think there were Zaxby's in Florida right before I left. Maybe. But like, usually they were a little more further north than that. No beats. A Alistair Kane knows he he's actually a Utah friend. Oh wow, they have their own mold drifter. And it's an elemental, so I can't even negative three Chandra to kill it. What a weird, like... It's very weird, like, the mix of elementals in this... Oh, you're going, going to my face now, because I'm at 27. Fascinating. And if they take four a turn, like, that's pretty good, right? Sylvan carry added is my guess. Noble Hierarch? That's close. Do they block this? I feel like they kind of have to block it, right? KFC for breakfast, don't mind if I do. It's funny that you guys have Kentucky Fried Chicken in Australia. It's like if there was a Brisbane Fried Chicken and we have it like in the US. BFC. Sydney Fried Chicken. Queensland Fried Chicken. KFC is the single largest franchise fast food chain in China. That's insane. That's crazy. It's just funny, like when a when a when a when a, like a a fast food chain with obviously like with with a specific country's roots, like in the name of all things, uh, is international. You know, that's just funny to me. You got it. You only have four, only four emblems a turn now. Everybody need a little cap here. I'll take two. Yeah, that was my thing. Like, Outback isn't an Australian company that, like, has has restaurants in America. It's literally the most American, like... Juposhi, it's still so weird seeing you back in chat, my dude. Walking Burlista for onesie. Yeah, pick that nose. I did it, buddy. I picked it. What are you going to do Thank about it? You. Alistair Kane with the gifted subs, man. Thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate you. Man, you guys are wild. Thank you. Oh, we just won the game. I guess they didn't see my onboard win condition. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Um, Thank you. Wish I had an answer for an Oblivion Ring. Where's that Rex Sage when you need it? Do we just burn Dramoka's command in like one Thank planes? You. Like we can get the planes with both. We have Noble Harak, Farseek, Sylvan Caryatid, planes, Windswept Heath. Thank you. 
Doesn't seem terrible. Well, yeah, I said noble. So we have noble, these three, and this in the plains. It also lets us fight things too, which is pretty decent. I'll take out one, one, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, six. Ancient Grudge literally deals with Coalition Relic and Walking Ballista, kind of. Those are like the only two things we've seen that Coalition Relic even touches. Well, we found the planes. This, this hand has all of our colors. If we can draw a uh, Sylvan Caryatid or Farseek or like Wolf Runs Hollow, I'd be pretty thrilled about this hand. Everybody need a little KFC. Oh, Farseek. Nicely done. I w see, I really I want two blue here. So I guess we're getting stomping ground at this, then island. <laughs> Tremovo's command. I want the chat to know that Michael B asked if he could join the stream and I said never again and he's here anyway. And I think that is just unbelievable. Love these socks for you. What'd you say to me? Dang it, Michael. <laughs> Dang it, Bobby. Are you literally breaking the things? I didn't break it. I just How do you know you didn't break it? You didn't even look at it yet. It's not broken. I didn't step on it. I just moved it a little bit with my foot. He moved it a little bit with his foot, ladies and gentlemen. God. Just under attack. I think the only solution is to chop his foot off. <laughs> Michael B. Jordan is a treasure. <laughs> he broke it. We can he did break it. You're right. Dustin, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Adam, thank you again for the five gifted subs. I really appreciate it. Badger, thank you for the 20 gifted subs, you ridiculous maniac. Oh, that did not feel like they had anything there. So I'm going to just slam a Tamiyo. Wow. Oh, they might have a counter. They just might have F6 during their turn. Yeah, that makes sense. Look at Katie's question. Katie, what's your question? Do you think if we go to Brothers Barbecue, they will think you're brothers or father son? Serious question. <sighs> <coughs> no. God, I really. Wait, if we go to what? Just because they're called brothers doesn't mean they think the people who go there are brothers. That doesn't even make any sense. No, if you don't go without a brother, you're not allowed in. <laughs> Where's your brother? It's still the same deck, right? No, it's a different deck. I don't Got even know why I ask you Got questions. Him. It gets me nowhere. I should have just pulled up the chat and asked the chat. I'll pull up your face and ask your face. What are you going to ask my face? Why is Michael so stupid? Wow. Got him. Guess what I'm into on my way to get my glasses fixed. Everybody. Wow. You're going to condemn this guy? Terrible. Just terrible. I 
I also have. <laughs> ooh, we got nothing there. All right, that's fascinating. I guess I'll tap down your red. If only I predicted condemn, I could have tapped down your white. But you only have two cards, so that could be good. Oh my god, really? This is not going to work the way you think it works. <laughs> Wait, what happened? Did they not oh, pay? Oh, yeah, they can't. <laughs> Everyone who goes there must go with their brother. Katie, that makes it real awkward that you and I went while I was visiting. I think they make exceptions for brother sisters. So they probably thought you were brother sister. Hmm. Right. That still makes it awkward, right? It does. But I'm just saying why they let you in. We can go in, man. Everything's closed, Michael. You know how. You know how life works. Well, they can't verify when you do delivery, so. You know. I should have just played this pre-combat, but I'm actually also playing. We didn't do delivery. We went and picked it up, man. God, you don't know anything. Well, you're just picking it up. You're not going to sit inside, so they're not going to bother with that check, you know. Awkward or hot? Not, not, not hot at all. That's disgusting. All right, we won this match because uh, two out of three games were decided by mana. But you won one game. Correct. I, I won two. I won two games. That's how I. That's how what I, do you mean? Like your opponent was mana screwed. That means two out of three games, one player was mana screwed. I got you. Okay. It's Michael. <sighs> listen to me, Michael. Are you listening? Okay. Good. Very good. I kept this two lander because any landless is Mole Drifter. Maybe our opponent named Cornea goes down to four cards too, you know? That could be good, right? Hunter has come to mess up the curtain. Do, 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 it's a terrible song. You didn't like it? No, it was terrible. I'm sorry. I'll rewrite it for you later. Rewrite it now, Michael. No, later. Michael, rewrite it right now. I don't, uh, got, my, I don't got my, you know, I'm not in my studio right now, you know? You know, you can't write a song unless you're in the studio? Yeah, man, it's, it's about the environment. I do not eat fish. Michael's mom eat fi eats fish, though. Uh, yes. Got her. Did you, though? Got her. <laughs> they used to call him his fish-eating mama. I'm just going to play this obstructionist. We're going to obstruct. Oh, yeah, remand that thing so then I can play my good spell next turn. I don't have a good spell to play next turn. Leave your head down just a touch. Why? You know why. A pee and care behind Mike B. It makes it look like he has a man bun. I don't... Is it? I don't think so. How do I... I think he's just oh, like that because it's like a little little top knot or whatever. Michael's man bun is beautiful. It's the most beautiful thing you'll ever see. Oh, Michael. Living in the garbage can. Bup. Yeah, boop. scry and then scry again shut up and take my money it's happening right now to America world police draft a red white blue because America and green team are super friends deck must mention Matt Damon guys I have like five steps in the queue I don't think I'm gonna be able to finish them all before the cube goes away literally tomorrow Oh, man. Recep, thank you so much, though. I really appreciate the support, and I will definitely keep it down here for, for either this this cube or future cubes. 
Is it like tomorrow night or is it like... No, like tomorrow. I don't, I don't know, know, man. It's basically just over as soon as you wake up. Yeah, as soon as I wake up, they, they shut off the... They're like, Frank's awake, and then they pull the switch. That's right. Oh, how nice. Let's draw a land here, huh? One land for your for your buddy boy. Let's get him. Team America. Shut up and take my money. Oh, good gravy. Whose money am I taking now? So are we friends again after our Mylar Facebook fight? Oh, yeah, that was only a 15-minute timeout of our friendship. That was only a 15-minute friendship timeout. Oh, Karanos is a good one. I think I'm close to getting a lifetime ban from the friendship. God, I hope so. <laughs> Oh, and then we're going to untap and Clever Impersonator. That's pretty good. Don't pack navigation this. That'd be... And then you really get a call in your, uh, <sighs> your cool. terrible situations. Well, you know what they say, Michael. Go on. I don't fucking <clears throat> care. Frank, are we friends again? Katie, were we ever not friends? America, again, coming again to save the motherfucking name. You know that jam? You know America? You know America? Fuck yeah! I know about the America. You know Team America? Yeah. They drew an island. Do you? What's your favorite team? What's your favorite member of Team America? Matt Damon. America, gross. Yeah, you're right. I blame all their coronavirus cases. America, disgusting. Are you friends? If so, do you know what the street value of our friendship is? I've got some credit cards. It's not high. It's nowhere near as high as, as that. Did you show Mutual his dad's online order, Frank? What does that mean? Oh, Super Fritz sent me a message and he was like, this is Mike's dad. <laughs> and, uh, and it says, Papa B. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so apparently your dad went to get cigarettes and just ended up in Ohio. Well, I already knew he was in Ohio, actually, so. Actually, let me push my little glasses up. Actually. Get busy stomping. I'll get busy stomping. Cigarettes and sandwiches are a pretty solid combo. Yeah, every, everyone knows the best way to enjoy a burger is with cigarettes on it. The best way to Mike's dad's heart is cigarettes and sandwiches. What's the deal here? You got two. You got two treasures. You gonna counter this thing with like a mana leak or some bullshit? Come on, cornea. A cigarette butt sandwich. Gross. Now I have the Team America song stuck in my head. You can only blame yourself. I blame your dad. That's weird. <clears throat> Delicious grapefruit soda. Ew, grapefruit soda. Disgusting. It's delicious. It's disgusting. Squirt is amazing, and you are wrong. I don't think squirt is grapefruit, is it? Look it up. Oh fuck, he's so he was so sure. Michael, tell him tell people how much you won. Guys, don't don't Google squirt. Maybe put soda after squirt. <laughs> oh boy! 
Oh, you mean about the poker games? Yeah, man. Tell them how much you no. Tell them how much you want the fucking Utah lottery. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so me and some old coworkers and a bunch of people that they know. And a bunch of my grandparents. Made a parents. poker group. And we play on a free-to-play app. And, uh, we just, you know, basically PayPal each other whoever wins. And, uh, I've won about... I got top two split in one game. I got second place in another game and second place in another game. They were all 10 to 11 people. There was rebuys allowed. So, all in all, I won about, uh, $340 if you don't include, uh, buy-ins and all that. That's so wild, man. This is a hell of a like, hell of a win rate. It's it could, this could be like a supplement of income for you, man. No, well, they haven't said anything about running a game tonight. So I'm really wondering, like, before they just stop inviting you, right? Like, is there's got to be a point where they're yeah, like, man, I only got second and split. I didn't ever actually. Yeah, but they first. know. Yeah, but you're still consistent enough. Three games, you get no worse than like second, right? Yeah. So like, that's pretty consistent, dude. Mom. Well, the thing is, though, there's a lot of players that in that group that think they're really good what they're not very oh good. dang shots fired i hate to say it but they make pretty bad decisions but he did not hate to say but, it. but uh although last night i gotta say the top three the other two players who were top three were actually like decent poker players and it actually was kind of a grind like it took a while um it took a while man i said fish and bit and did do but i mean i i've seen people calling all in with 10 7 off so mike do you like poker better than commander Ooh, that's close get him oof one two three four five six man i can't play any of the double blue card the double red double red cards i guess at the end of the day if i had to pick one i'd probably go with poker So, attack for two, put them in a nine. This puts them to five. That's two Karanos triggers. America, Mike B. Go one, two, three, four, come and again to be Mike B. And uh, the only reason I didn't get first was because um, <clears throat> I went all in and had ace king, and my opponent had a pair of threes, and the board came uh, ace something three. So I was like, oh well, maybe I can catch up if I, if I hit an ace. But then it just became three three, so he just ended up hitting quads off his pocket threes. So you know, just casual flipping the quads, no big deal. Luck sack. Actually, the weird thing is, like, I think four or five times in the games I've played, people have shoved with aces and actually just got destroyed. Like, yeah. it's just weird. It just keeps happening. Well, you mean ace? You mean pair aces? Pair yeah. aces? Like, going all in pre fall with aces and they get cracked. It's happened, like, four times. That's pretty frequent. But, I mean, I also did win with aces a couple times, so. Cornelius Von Cobb, huh? And his rat friend... Wow, that's racist. Send them on down to rat train. A speciesist. Have you ever been outside and got to call on the rat train? <laughs> but uh, I basically play like a little, a little, a little bitch, if you will. I just play super, super conservatively until like top four, and then I switch gears and get more aggressive. That's basically all I do. Mike, why you no stream poker? Well, I'm not playing on an actual legitimate poker site, so there's no way to really stream it. Yeah, he just plays on an app. And the reason I like playing super tight early and then aggressive later is because everyone gives me the credit for having better hands by that point, so I can get away with bluffs that I shouldn't. Also, like when it comes down to about four players, people tend to get super conservative on themselves and just auto fold to like continuation bets on the turn. Oh, it's a rift wing cloud skate, you see. Ooh. 
Ooh, someone got a new job. Nice. If I don't watch as much as I used to. Oh, man, dude. Lance, that would be awesome, man. Congrats on the new job, buddy. How far is your commute? You're going to bounce my frosty tea. Sure. I mean, but if, like, if I were to just consistently do that well every time we played, I'd be averaging, like, $80 a game, which is pretty good. Yeah, but there's no way they keep letting you like the the problem is that it's a home game, you know. Like at at a certain point, they're like, "No, I'm not gonna play anymore, man." No, I'm gonna keep riding it out until that happens. So, playing super tight is the best way to gamble. Katie's right. Katie is actually uh, she's she's had a a gambling problem for a long time. No, I'm just kidding. I don't want that to. I mean, there's definitely a lot a way to play loose well, but it's very hard to pull off and you generally have to be playing against better players if you're playing loose who won't just call you with like mid to low pairs and stuff the motherfucking are you a chicken what are you a chicken <laughs> I'll never tell hmm. you'll never know Get rid of this thing. If I destroy spell sketch in response to them changing the target, it does it fizzle? Also, I think I might have mentioned it earlier, but a lot of people in the group think they're like good poker players. So I don't know. They might just continue to keep letting me crush them. I mean, we'll see, I guess. Oh my, come on. That's not what I wanted to do. I That's so fucking dumb, dude. No, there are no, uh, there are no casinos in Utah. Target does not go back to the original target, apparently. I might have had to do it in response, I guess. Six, seven, eight. Potentially 11 next turn. That's really dumb. Yep, cool. So I guess just take another six from Karanos for no reason. Oh, they flipped their <laughs> their Azcanta, so their Karanos is no longer a creature. What did you talk about the Karanos trigger? The Riftwing Cloud Skate. I mean, any blue or red permanent turns it back on, right? One, two, three, four, and I have six, so. <sighs> Kolagon's command, shooting this and getting back warm coil engine. That seems good. Thank you. John Desor, thanks so much for the resub. Doomsday, thank you so much for the resub. Thank you guys, really appreciate it. Welcome back, guys. Welcome back. Wow. Mm. Michael, this is your mother. Take that out of your hand right now. <laughs> What was in your hand? My phone. Typical. Wow, they didn't they didn't play Worm Coil Engine. Just 
So I assume they have, what does this guy do? Whenever you cast in or sorcery, deals four damage to any target. But up, but up, but up, but up, but up, but up. We really have to play Chandra, but we don't get a second red source in 20 card. In half our deck, we only have one red source. So, you know. Like you do. I assume they're going to Cryptic Command bounce Karanos here. That just resolved. Okay. It's fascinating. They didn't even activate his content in response. They're just going to Teferi. Got it. The phone is fine. Just don't start with the ice the ice ever again. Well, there's no ice in this house, so don't have to worry about it. We don't live in a house with ice. There's anti-ice laws in Utah. It's true. Okay. I got another dude. Get another, get another beastie boy. I mean, if we get a second red, we could just go... <coughs> Thunderball Karanos, but then we also have to hit a non land. So just those two, huh? I'll take eight. Again, not playing the dude. Boo doo boo Ba -doom, ba -doom, ba -doom. Graveyard? Yeah, you can go to the graveyard. Um, Yes, I will actually flip you now. Sure. They still have six mana. They can still cast Worm Coil. Yep. <sighs> hey, second red. One, two, three. Never thought I'd see the day. Chandra negative six actually seems pretty decent here, right? Wow. Because they can't, if they flash in Worm Coil in response, they lose their guys. Well, if they want to try to counter our Chandra, that would be... Oh. <laughs> Epic. <laughs> it happens so much. Oh, man. You done messed up, A.A. Ron! Yeah, no, that doesn't work. It's a good try, though. Oh, we can't negative six everything. Never mind. I'm an actual idiot. Why not? Because that's not how Chandra works. She deals three damage to things, not six damage. And getting rid of Teferi seems pretty decent here. But then they flash in that Worm Coil. Yeah. For some reason, I thought you could deal negative six to everything, but that is not how she works. How are they going to flash in the Worm Coil? Because they have Teferi the same way they flashed in Frost Titan. Oh, you mean like next turn? Mm, oh, no, because they use Disallow. Oh, wow. Oh, I was like, I'm missing treasures or something? What's going on? How is he going to play that? This guy's still alive? Jesus. <sighs> okay, I'm pretty sure we're dead then. Yep. Despite our opponent wasting a counterspell. <clears throat> I'm going to bring in this myself.
Still is very good if we can get it down early enough. Um, another situation where I don't hate Dramoka's command just because it will get rid of their Karanos. Oh, Michael's checking his little telephone to see if his mother left him any messages. Checking to see if there's another poker game. <laughs> oh, is there another poker game, Bobby? Tell me about my poker games. Oh, yeah, my mom tells me about it. Yeah, oh, that's really weird. Why don't you hear it from your friends? Well, it's just the way it is, man. I don't, I don't make the rules. But what if you did make the rules? That'd be a different world. Would it be? Yes. What kind of world would that be, Michael? A different one, man. I don't know. I don't know what kind of world it would be. I don't know about worlds. His mom is his friend. Mutual blink six times if you make the rules. Uh, Guys, can you count Michael's blinks for me? I want to make sure we get the six. I'm pretty sure we already have. Okay, so you do make the rules, you fucking liar. No, I'll go past the six. So it still counts. There you go. Did you blink six times? I blinked more than six times. But that still is six, no, isn't it? No, when you say you blink six times, that means you blink six times. I blinked more than that, so it doesn't count. Michael. Just stop it. I blinked more than six times. Yeah. All the juice is on the loose in my body. The juice is on the loose in your body? Yeah. Weird. Nobody wants to hear about your loose juice, Michael. Don't lie. Name one person in the chat who wants to hear about your loose juice. Uh, no beats. Dang. What if you, yeah, what if you do make the rules, and then after the sixth blink, you change the rules to blink any number of times? <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, wow. That's wild, dude. I feel like at least two people in chat want to know about the loose juice. <laughs> Good lord, man. This is very strange. They're going to disallow this, but that's fine. What if they didn't, though? That'd be super cool. Be a lot cooler if you didn't. No, you're right. You can't do it. Yep. To the surprise of no one. I don't want to live in a world where my opponent never has the counter spell. Also, it's really funny to disallow Chandra when she can't be countered, given the fact that if you let it resolve, you can counter her ability with disallow. It's true. Oh. Michael's making really gross noises inside, so... Are you laughing at my yeah my Hanson? I think I have a little Caesar's problem. Yeah, I know you do. Especially because you're like, oh, I'll get some dinner when we get back. And then like, I see you picking up little Caesar's at the door and I'm like, oh. Well, you didn't get back till like seven. 
Oh, not seven. That's way too late for dinner. Right? No, but... Oh. I wanted to get food before I started my poker game. and Oh, wow. Even then, I, I ended up playing while eating because that's just how it went. But Oh, wow. I don't know, man. Their deep dish, extra cheese, well done. Oof. It's good. And it's so cheap, I had to order a soda to avoid a fee. Do I just get to eat this guy? That's pretty interesting, right? Some of us like to eat early and being and being able to adjust before laying down. <laughs> As many, I know that seems weird, but Little Caesars, if you if you order something for delivery and it's under ten dollars, they charge you a small order fee, which is two dollars. So, I just got a soda for two dollars, and so the soda is basically free. Wow. I guess I technically could have gone and picked it up to avoid that, but wow. Didn't want to wait thirty minutes in line, so wow, <laughs> wow. Wow. There it goes. Hum bump stip a dap stop but the lap skip it about papa do wop skip it baby de bit about do bit about up to papa dip it down do you bop skip it down papa dip dee. This is Hanson, you ever heard Hanson? Yes. That's just that's pretty I don't even that's Owen Wilson. That's something, alright. That's that's something. I had a dream about pizza last night. I have a dream about pizza every night. It's a pretty good dream. Oh, they're going to run this? Are you going to make your dream a reality uh, by getting yeah. pizza? No, Michael. I'm not talking to you. I know you're not. I know who you are talking to. You how dare you talk to me like that? Are you going to make your dream a reality by getting pizza? My name is Michael Pizza. I work at the pizza factory. That's cool. That's a cool Rakdos signet. You some kind of duck? What are you, some kind of stupid idiot? Yes. <laughs> Got him. This is where a cryptic command happens. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh, um, wrong. What was our cryptic command? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Maybe they just won't ever draw anything. Maybe. Maybe. Michael B. Oh, Michael B. Ba, ba, da. Michael B. Michael B. Yeah, pay your five mana. Or don't. Or That'd be epic. Don't pay it. Katie, tell me about your pizza dream. Sweet. It was filled with gluten and very taste. So basically, you just had a dream about the pizza we ate literally on like Saturday. What do I want to draw? I want to draw Chandra here when they have nothing on board. I don't think that's too much to ask. Mountain is actually very close to a. Uh, to a Chandra. What? 
I'll be there when Michael be all day. Yeah, man, you can make a clone of that thought there. I'm, I know. I'm going to do it, too. There's nothing you can say about it. Now, that would be an interesting line. It's the most interesting line. Just like man is the most dangerous game. Think about it. Okay. I'm going to activate my Ascon to the sunken ruin. It's going to be so sunken. Yep. Oh, they whiffed. Wonderful. Just wonderful. Glorious. I kind of want to go back to bed. Badger, what time is it there, my dude? It's got to be super early. I think you're like 11 hours ahead or something. So like 6 a.m., 8.30 a.m. Badger, you can totally go back to bed, dude. You've clearly been up for like an hour and a half. Um. Hmm. I've been sleeping all day and night. Does that mean you're sleeping right now while typing that? Oh, wow. That's wild. Oh, Badger, get those gains, my dude. Oh, boy. That's exciting. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Do you have enough mana to play it and equip it to a activated lumbering fall? Yes, but then they just block. Oh, true that. But I guess that's fine. You don't really have anything to cast anyway, right? I have a clever impersonator, Michael. What are you going to do about that? It's no real good targets for Choose you. your cryptic command modes. Spell pierce. <sighs> okay. You must like their last card. Dude, dude. I want to make them tap it, so... Because now they can't activate his Kanta. I'll just kill this guy so they can't be flashing back like. Well, nothing in the graveyard really gets flashed back very well, but that's fine. Next turn, we'll just equip the Sword to the Lumbering Falls. See what that does. Unless they go, unless they top deck Cake Man and they kill Sword and get back Worm Coil and cast Worm Coil. That'd be pretty sad. No, they don't have black mana, right? Oh, yeah, they do. So can't take them anywhere. <laughs> sure. One and one. Okay, you have one card in hand. I think we're going to connect. I have a good feeling about it. For the first time ever. That's going to help us connect. <laughs> Let's equip it here and get in there for a million damage. Do -do 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 Tap down my thopter. Oh, you're going to do searchy search. Okay. Oh, Phyrexian Arena. Wow, you have 11 minutes. They're five? Jeez. T -t -t Today, Junior? Nope, don't want to do that. Let's... 
Hello, two humans. Hello, human. Oh, they got rid of the arena. I got a double black card in this deck? That's wild. The great is real. I kind of want to just clever impersonator the Thassa, but I don't think it does anything. Yeah, I don't know what that would do for you. Well, let's just start exiling things. You know. So I mean, we have Pact of Negation. There's nothing like that. I feel like there's nothing they can really do here, so. Do, 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 do. Oh, they're digging. Oh, they're digging. I had some KFC today. Okay. Yeah. How was right. it? Oh, Colagon's Command. That's a good one. How was it? Yeah. Uh, delicious. Like, surprisingly good. What'd you get? I got a big, a KFC big meal box or whatever they are. Strips or? Sandwich with Nashville hot sauce on it. It didn't feel like there was enough sauce on it. Chicken, yeah, it's good, but you got to ask for extra sauce. Chicken sandwich is actually surprisingly good, though. I mean, their chicken's good. Their chicken's good. And that's all they do. It better be, you know. It's all they do. I feel like I just no. I think Lumbering Falls is actually pretty MVP this round because it's like allowing us to break through their Thassa. Look at us bringing in this pack of negation like a boss. Does that mean he's gonna give him more? Carolina Gold, I love a I love a mustard based barbecue sauce. You can get caught between the moon and New York City. That's to assert my dominance. Got him. They gotta win the next game in four minutes. That's wild. And that's doable. Doable? Yeah, doable. It's doable? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Like that jam I'm doing? Yeah, that's what I thought. Hmm. You okay? Your steal of champion seems ambitious. Really? Like... We have 11 green sources, 12 green sources. I just don't think you're going to cast on three, though. Oh, what if I cast on four? It's five, four for four. That can't be blocked. It's still decent. I guess it's okay. What about five? And then it starts to get bad. Okay. I don't think we've seen it yet, though, so it doesn't really matter. La 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 Michael B. What are we looking for here? Nothing good. Sword? All right, I'll take it. You can go between the moon and New York City. That's what you can do. Is Mike B shoulder shaking or is that the? Uh, it's it's, no, it's, it's just it's he's shaking. He has a uh, has a, a a weird problem with his leg where he can't keep it still. He's it's got a thing. He's got like restless leg syndrome. And now you said something. I don't feel like doing it anymore. I don't. I don't even want to do it anymore. Now that you said something, let's just bounce this. Thank you. 
Sound sure, like Garner. He's... Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Sounds like he's got the Jimmy legs. He does have the Jimmy legs. I don't think they're going to win in three minutes, man. I'll be honest with you. No, man. In two turns, they got a 2-2 two -two with haste. In what turns? In two turns. What did you say, though? In two, two turns. I said in two turns. You, you didn't. Yeah, so, I did. Roll the videotape. <laughs> Get out of here. Get him. You think this is going to resolve? If it does, I think we're going to win. Ah, my God, I ween. Oh, that's just fine. I will definitely pay two for that, my dude. Are we going to two one? Man. Is there a mode I can I can I can suspend the I can nimble obstructionist the last counter on that, right? Uh I would think so. Because the last counter comes off and then the suspend goes on the stack, right? I guess I should have used this one, huh? I guess it wouldn't have mattered. I'm untapping two mana worth anyway, so. Oh my god. What's happening right now? Wow, Teferi just to block. That's After the counter is taken off, it triggers again, letting them cast it, counter the second trigger. Yes. Yeah, wow, they just literally just to block? That's wild. That's what you can do. Okay, so suspend. Is it this one? I don't know. Uh, this is this is the trigger from Earthwind Cloudscape. Remove a time counter. This is the cast trigger. Yes, okay. And we get to draw a card. That's wild. That's wild and out. So that's that what the kids say? Wild and out? I think some kids say that. What are you eating for dinner, Michael? I hadn't planned that far ahead. <laughs> Have you? No, I had KFC like an hour ago. Oh, is that recent? When do you think? It, I mean, it was like three. When do you think it was? I don't know, like at a reasonable lunchtime? three o'clock isn't a reasonable lunch time for you not really wow i'm so sorry that I, my my lunch doesn't conform to your lunch standards <laughs> i'm gonna play two spells that can't be countered this turn that seems like it'll probably win the game oh we didn't even get to play two two one with the teamer deck was a little discouraged at first. Didn't think it was going well. Then it turned around. Thank you guys for watching. Slendos, like, and subscribe. Check me out on Twitch. Was that any of that words? No, it was like the Micro Machine guy. Patreon.com slash Frank Lepore. Cool Stuff Inc. and Mana Traders. All of the links and promo codes are in the description below. Check those out. Great way to support the channel. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.